Up next, we're going to discuss Cameron Brait. And now that Jameis Winston is back in the fold for Tampa Bay, he might be going back to his favorite tight end, right, Greg? And you hit the nail on the head right there, Maria. Jameis Winston will be the starting quarterback when the Tampa Bay Buccaneers come out of the bye. We just talked about Vance McDonald and how tight end is a really tough position to fill. If you just find one, you're golden. And Cameron Brait may be that golden ticket. Not only is Jameis Winston back in the saddle at quarterback for Tampa Bay, but O.J. Howard's hurt. He's going to be out at, at least two to four weeks with a sprained MCL similar to Evan Ingram's injury. Every person heals differently, and the bye does come at a good time. But these are now two big reasons to really like Cameron Brait going forward. It's not easy to find a tight end. And if you have one that you can rely on Cameron Brait in the first game with Jameis Winston back, catches a touchdown, not a coincidence. He's Jameis Winston's favorite target. He's not somebody that is just off the scrap heap. Remember, Tampa Bay gave him a contract extension coming into this season. Not somebody that's going to get cut. He's not somebody that's going to get replaced. Cameron Brate's always going to be out there, whether Howard is or he isn't on the field. For the near future, he's not going to be on the field, which means a whole lot more Cameron Brate. I love the pickup. It's a great stash during the bye week. We say it all the time about tight ends. If you get in the end zone once, you're in business, and he did that last week. And even without Jameis Winston starting the game, um, we had Cameron Brate netting over 10 fantasy points for FanDuel, and that's exactly what you want at tight end.